हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू द फ्री ऑटोमेशन लर्निंग चैनल एंड माय नेम इज चिराग सिंह एंड टुडे वी विल डिस्कस हाउ वी कैन हैंडल ड्रैग एंड ड्रॉप फंक्शनैलिटी इन थ्रू सेलिन वेब ड्राइवर इन मैनी एप्लीकेशन आई फाउंड एंड आई फाउंड एंड आई फेस्ड दैट वी हैव टू डू ड्रैग एंड ड्रॉप फंक्शनैलिटी वी हैव टू टेस्ट और वी हैव टू ऑटोमेट दैट फंक्शनैलिटी Uh, so here i'm going to uh, create a video so that you guys aware about that drag and drop functionality can be done by this action class also and how can we write and what would be the code and how uh, we can uh, easily automate that uh, drag and drop functionality i will will explain you in this video so today agenda would be introduction of action class i already discussed about action class uh, you can watch my previous video that is 31 video tutorial 31 in that video i already discussed about what is a action actions class what is a action if you have any doubt or any query you can mail me so next point would be how can we handle drag and drop functionality through selenium web driver i will discuss you and third use of drag and drop method so i will show you about the drag and drop method how can we use this method and what would be the parameter uh, will uh, we have to pass uh, to work on this method and last uh, code i will design a code in front of you so that you can understand the code and i will put this code into git you can download that code so guys before starting this uh, drag and drop i will show the demo uh, application where i am going to uh, use this functionality or perform this fun uh, functionality drag and drop so i am going to show you this is my demo application and you can see this is a drag me to target and drop here so i have to first drag here and i am doing here manually and then i will Uh, write the code to do it by automation right so drag me here i drag it and drop here and i am going to release so this would be my the scenario which i am going to automate right so let me open eclipse and will create a new class that would be a tutorial 33 as i am going to use by java so i put click a uh, static void main method and generate comments this would be my class now uh, as i usually did i am going to create a method for setup for setup i have to first declare a web driver now i am going to maximize this will give implicit weight also that is second time unit would be 30 seconds now i am going to get the url for you I just copy this URL from here and will paste there here and will create a method. This would be a public void drag and drop. So in this first we will create a object of actions class. What is the actions? class action class is used or provide a method for us so that we can use drag and drop functionality right click and other functionality so this here create 
x and object of x in class. Here would be my code. So act dot drag and drop. Let me this drag and drop. So you can see in drag and drop there are two method. First is drag and drop, and it will uh, yeah, we have to provide two web element. First for source and second for target. And third is a uh, method in which I have to provide uh, source and uh, uh, this method would be used when we do not have a target we just have to drop in uh, on the screen anywhere and we just give uh, int x and y so at that time we have to use this method but here in my case I have a uh, source and target element so we will gonna to use this right so let me show you this so this is my source and this is my target because I have to drag here and drop here let me first create this method so you can see this is a drag web element and this would be a drop right so you can see this is method inside a iframe so first we have to switch into this iframe guys who do not watch my video about the iframes uh, just go and watch because this is a very necessary topic in this selenium web driver so the syntax of a switching iframe is driver dot switch to dot frame here i am going to switch by web element so i will give driver dot find element by dot class name and class name would be this right now i have to here i will write switch to src is equal to driver dot find element by dot id and what would be the id id is this dragable and now i have to identify target target web element where i have to release this so this would be web element target is equal to driver dot find element by dot id and what would be the id id for this is this so i will copy and paste here now code for guys this is a very basic line and you can see by using by using this drag and drop you thought that there would be very large code but this is a very simple because the selenium web driver already provide us a method for this right so this is only a code which we have to write in this drag and drop so i have write, uh, written all the code now i am going to create an object for this tutorial 32 33 because this is a 33 or tutorial so that i will call my method this subject and this would be drag and drop and i will going to run and see what would be the output here so I run, I already run, now Firefox will launch soon. You can see Firefox has been launched and soon uh, website has been loaded and you can 
see that drag and drop functionality has been run successfully so this code would run successfully you can see so this would be the line and what would be the this for the source which is source means this this would be a source and this would be a target so i identify this let me open This is our source and this is our target, right? So let me show you the this our source and this our target and this for the drag and drop functionality. By using this perform method, we can uh, execute this code or this code would be executed by this. If I will not put this perform, so that uh, at that case my code would not perform, right? So guys, hope fully you understand the this code and and you like this video and i will come with a new topic till then 